Hey everybody, Tom Joya from Visionary Music Group here. Part two of our Anatomy of a Mix of the tune Feel by the Sahara Club, Michael Thompson, Stanley Clark, Jeff Lorber, and many more talented people on this. I was lucky enough to mix it, so let's break down the drums and the loops. Here we go. So this was a little break from the traditional setup where there really wasn't a drum kit or separated drum elements making this up. There were a, different loops and different program drums that were stacked to create different feels. So let's check those out and see what we have. So first thing that came up that sort of introduces the drums is this big fill. Then we have a kick. and claps. Now we bring in some loops. So let's see how I manage the four loops there. So here's, let me get a little loop on the loops, so to speak. So here's loop one. So first thing I did with all these was phase align them to the to this loop. So I put Phoenix on it to give it a little some something and the SSL channel for a little flavor. Second loop. SSL channel for feel third loop. So the, th so the third loop I have triggered by a side chain over here. So let's check it out. So I use the decapitator to give it a lot of that flavor. Then this Saturn to distort some of the low end. So this is the loop with nothing on it. Here's the Saturn. Here's the decapitator. And here's the SSL, which we need a side chain for to make it all be happy. And we have a clap. So what's cool about this is these are not my first pick kind of sounds I would have went for, but it's exactly what he was hearing. So that's great. And it made it easy for me to dial it in. So I'll see the effect of the side chain on the drums and percussion and see how the side chains really like brought them to life. So I'm going to highlight my side chains and then I will mute them. Okay. So here's some drums and percussion. Side chains out. Side chains in. So the side chains give them a little more weight and a little more attack. It's not as drastic as maybe some of the rock mixes I would do, but it, it helps bring them forward a little bit. Let's hear that section in context with the, you know, all the drums. So as you can hear, it breaks down, little things come out in different spots. So what happens is during the solos, this loop comes in, which is cool. Oh, 
Oh, we have the other elements. Here's that same part, and I'll pop that big loop in and out. So that's there to really ramp things up a little. Then there's per other percussion, congas, and different things are added during the solo sections to bring them up. It's a really, really nice arrangement. Let's hear that section with that big loop we just heard in and out with the rest of the band. So it's a really great backbeat reinforcer. All right, so that was part two of our Anatomy of a Mix of the Tune Cold Feel by Sahara Club, Michael Thompson, Stanley Clark, Jeff Lorber, and many more luminaries on this. Credits below. It's out on Sirius XM now on the Waterfall channel, so check it out. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit the like button. Please subscribe. Hit the notification bell so we can let you know when more content like this is coming. We're going to do part three next, and we're going to cover the Mighty Stanley Clark bass part. So tune in then. Thanks again. Happy mixing.